people welcome to another vlog today we are going to St Helens bus rally well that if it's uh, if it's a good bus rally because last year it was good so hopefully they do that roll again this shit today so if it isn't good we're gonna do some just Sunday service work I guess and yeah we are in Blackpool at the moment we are heading down to Blackpool North yep we're heading down to Blackpool North and it might be a good day it might be not it might be a, a decent a decent uh, a decent bush rally like last time and yeah gonna be brilliant that's the new primary in and yeah let's get to to today hopefully the trains are not on strike like they always are and also should be it's very quiet uh, this morning up in Blackpool they're all probably sleeping after a good night out. <laughs> uh, it doesn't say that my train's cancelled anyways on the on the app, so we should be go. Because they they've been rubbish this year as well, trains. Because they're always being uncancelled. But some services are cancelled. I don't know how, and I don't know why. It's probably lack of staff, I think. And not much staff. Not much staff to do to run that service. So, some, some trains uh, uh, are not running. But they are running today, which is brilliant. So yeah guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Hit that like button, hit subscribe. I'll see you, see you in a bit. So I've got 331019. What's the car trouble there? It's a car trouble there, nice etc. And also I've got 331. Let's see what I've got. If I can see it. 005 331 005 and 331 019 all the way to uh, Liverpool Lime Street but I'm getting off at St Helens so yeah I'll sit in my spot report it to a member of staff or the British Transport Police via text on 61016. We'll sort it. See it, say it, sort it. Sort it. 
This isn't really my regular spot, but yeah, that's it, yeah. Going. We're going to St. Evans. Welcome aboard this Northern Service 2, Liverpool Lime Street. The next station stop is Putton La Fylde. station
you see the line from uh, from Fleetwood in a, in a minute. Cleaver is that way around. There you go. That's the, the Cleveland line in the old back in the old days. It's still there, it's just they were gonna do one to to bottle the file, but the plan didn't really come. So This is Hope the Fild. Hopefully in the in the future they, they might they might redo it again. That'd be nice. Heritage line. Well, this is going to be a long video, so get your popcorn ready. <laughs> We're approaching Kirkham and Wesham now. It thought that the platform was on the right hand side. That's hilarious. Then it changed it to, to the left. <laughs> Must have been another line there in the, in the old days, just right there. I like history and all that stuff. I like on the railways. Yeah, that must be in... Uh, Another platform as well. This is Kirkham and Wesson. Must have been a big station. Not too long though. It's probably about 45 minutes. So. Here we are now arriving at Preston. There's a West Coast Mail line, just right there. Still need to go on one of them three three nine sevens. I think it's three nine seven in the words. Actually no I don't because I've had one from Edinburgh to Preston, so yeah, I've done one of them. I just realised. There we are. At Preston. Preston. Like the guy said, it's Preston. Next stop is Leyland. We're gonna see lots of Leylands today, hopefully. good station this as well because it says Leyland on it oh yeah definitely we're definitely gonna see loads of these today at St Helens that pretty cool for plant pot <laughs> it's pretty awesome that. Just halfway now, I am at Wigan Northwestern. 
on the West Coast Main Line. London to Edinburgh, or London to Glasgow, I think. If you'd like me to go to London one day to get to scan your Omni Cities and Omni Deckers and all that, comment down below. If there's any Omni Deckers, maybe with someone else like uh, Stagecoach uh, down south or something. I don't know if there's any Omni Deckers, I think it's Omni Cities. To be honest, Om Omni City Double Deckers. But yeah, I would like to get them as well. Because it might have been changing here or maybe at Preston if I wanted to go to London. This is Wigan Northwestern. Change here for London, Scotland and other national and local destinations. Next stop now is Gaswood and my next station stop is St Helens. It should be arriving there soon. That's the one singing in the other this carriage. There we are, we are Mercy Rail. St. Helens Central. Mind the gap between the train and the platform edge. There's a lot of history in this room. Just station. A lot of history in this train station. There's loads of abandoned railway tracks around here. Here we are guys at St Helens Central, Arriva Land. Yeah, if you walk up here, you can see the old railway line. Pretty 
saw that. It's pretty awesome. That's pretty cool out there. We'll be seeing them today. Alright guys, here we are at St Helens Central. Oh, we've got a mini solar. Yeah, pretty cool. I uh, don't know who that is, but yeah, I'll have a look in a bit. Uh, when I get my internet on and all that stuff. But yeah, here's down the bus station. It's down here, it's not too far away. It's not even too far away to pretty much the St. Helens uh, Transport Museum. Sounds nice, that Mark. I think it's a Mercedes Benz that, or Cummins engine. I'm not too sure, really. But yeah, anyways. Today plan is if it's good I will I'll put it to me. Today's plan if it's good I will stay around doing uh, heritage vehicles. If not I'll do some Arriva stuff as well. So I might even go down to Liverpool or whatever. And I think it should be a good day with the transport museum because it was uh, last year so fingers crossed hopefully it'd be a good day so it, it's uh, pretty much a long video already you know so yeah it's just gonna be a popcorn ready video I think uh, yeah should see good, some good friends uh, some some nice buses so speaking of buses are we going the wrong way? it's that way not that way but yeah speaking of them buses there they are looks like there's an open top of there I think it is that way I think it's not like not in it's there it's just right there so Pretty cool. There's a Leyland National there. Looks like an, a, a Leyland open top at Atlantean over there. So I would need a thumbnail. So let's have a thumbnail with them all. Hopefully, there's more come to come later on. So pretty much it's not really that far away from the bus station. There's some MMCs down here. I'm gonna go photo them. I'll see you guys whenever I turn my camera towards me. So hope you enjoy the video. So, what we have here then? Oh, crunch! He just uh, hit his bumper on the on the pavement there. Uh. So we have a Leyland National with Nest Cooperation, and it wasn't a Atlantean. It was a half cab. It's a uh, open topper a Leyland. FFY 404 I think I need this one so this will be uh, probably in the vlog today it's a Leyland
It's a Leland Titan PD2 open topper. And this looks like a, another Leyland, it's definitely a Leyland. Yep, definitely a Leyland. <laughs> this is another Leyland Titan PD2. I don't think I need this one though. There's a pulsar over there. So hopefully more than three will attend later on. It's a bit early for now. It's 10 o'clock and hopefully it should arrive. Apparently I do need bed 731C. I've just checked on my YouTube channel. I do need uh, a video of this. So I'll be going on that. I, I'll check uh, if I, I need the national. But I'm not too sure if I do. I think I've done it before. So I'll check on that one. So it's them two buses what I need. The two PD2s. One open top and one closed top. Well, apparently it's just done free. Bloody hell, really? Oh god. Apparently it's M3, so I guess it's gonna be them free and pretty much service work. Oh well. At least I've, I've got three credits anyways. I need that national as well. So, let's uh, enjoy today on buses and service work. So it's just M3 today. I thought it would have been more because it's a fun day and heritage rides. So I thought there would have been more. I guess not. So it might be half day for me then in uh, the Mercy side. Let's stick my camera in here and have a look there. Looks nice though. Looks fresh. At least it's only a little vlog then, I guess, around this bit. They've got over 60 buses and then they're only just doing three. But it's a bit lame, isn't it, to be honest. People want to come all this way for these buses as well. But yeah, at least, at least it's something to do, I guess, on a Sunday. Hey right, guys, uh, we just arrived into the Northwest St. Helens Bus Museum. Hopefully I don't get copyrighted off this music, uh, but I'm not bothered because I'd, I'm not hit 1,000 subscribers yet. So I just hopefully it doesn't block my music, uh, f the sound. This is a beast anyway, it's, uh, uh, it's a Dennis, Dennis Dart, but it's got a five gearbox on it. There's a Houghton transport, some uh, little buses, bus models. So yeah, I'm here to, I might even actually go down by back to Blackpool by bus, I guess. This is what I want, right here. I missed this last, last year, the right beast. I love my Lynx is me, I really do. If I do want a bus, it would be a Lynx. Because Lynxes are amazing. I just really do like Lynxes. So much. 
Looks like a Blackpool transport seat there. <laughs> but yeah, I do really like Lynx. Is a, this will be my uh, one of my favourites. And I've been on one of these in Liverpool, and oh my god, they are they are weird, weird little things here. I've been on one of these. Why does it need to be triaxle? Why? Long wheelbase, probably. But yeah, I'm gonna see. So it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12 and a wheelchair on a seated 12 it's got them slidey windows pretty cool just weird this bus seriously it's just a bodywork it's just a techno bus does it play music on it techno <laughs> there's a Blackpool tram Blackpool Tr uh, Corporation brush car, I think. Or is it a coronation? I don't know. I don't know my trams, to be honest. I think it's a coronation, this one. This is a coronation tram. 281. Yeah, this used to be a also a tram depot in the old days for, for uh, St. Ellen's. Here's a Reva Routemaster. A Reva London Routemaster RML 2452. And there it is. Oh, maybe not. It's a different one. But yeah. These are just uh, random pictures of uh, different ones. That's when there was a... Uh, Doing, uh, doing the bodywork on it. Uh, I like this little smiley face one. It's fun. This is a 466. And what is this? Is it a, is it a Leyland? It's the Lancaster Cooperation Tram. Uh, tram. Uh, that's a fail. It's a bus, actually. Not a tram. Because I've got a lot of tram in my head and uh, yeah, I've just uh, pretty much called this a tram. But no, it's not. Right, does it say, it's, I think it's a, it's a half cab obviously, it's single, single decker. I think it's a Leyland Titan anyways. But yeah, there's a Leyland uh, PD2 there. Or is it PD3? I don't know. I don't know which one. But yeah, this is a Leland Atlantean with a Chester City Transport. I think I do need this one. Because rarely do they go out. They're trying to fit a elephant in the bus. Really? It's YMA 99W. YMCA. <laughs> It's YMCA Airbus. Uh, there's a little Morris. Morris fan. I think that must be Morris down there, just driving it, just right there. Hello, Morris. And that's his partner. That's uh, this bus here, Ribbon. Or maybe not. I don't know why. I think I think these are just billboards, to be honest. For just, like, different pictures. I don't think they represent, uh, like, the buses next to it, you know. But, yeah, here's Blackpool, uh, Blackpool Airport. I think we, we should have our own airport back, I think. So, yeah. Come on, Blackpool Council, open the airport again. Here's a Leyland Atlantean. Also, here's a couple more half cabs. A Chester City of Chester. Uh, this is a Bristol VR. 
a VRT, the ECW. Go into mode uh, in Wales. Has a uh, pretty much a Leland Titan, I think. There's loads of Leland Titans here. No, actually, it's it's a Daimler with an EC engine in it. How can it be a Daimler and an EC engine? That's weird. That's that's new to me. There's a Dennis. This is a fire. It looks like an American fire truck with all the big tires and everything in it. But no, nope, it's West Riding's fire truck. This is an RAF. So it, it looks like an army fire truck, this. An army fire truck. It's a Bedford. Bedford. Royal Air Force on that one. This is Dennis Dominator. Numbered Fleet numbered ninety nine. Wonder if there's ninety nine of them. You know, that'll be a lot of Dennis Dominators. Right, here's 109. Is it AC Reliance? There's a Ford Transit here. A couple of badges. There's a national badge there. A Leland badge. Bedford Blacksons. There's the leopard badge just right there. And on its own is the Volvo badge with a couple of Bristol VR and Leyland badge just right there. And a couple of cyclists as why not. This is a nice uh, fashion car here. Very long and a long hood on it. Bloody hell. That is big. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm joking. It's a, a, a Lincoln American car, American car. And has a, an old fashioned type car. I don't know what. The, that symbol is that sign is but yeah this is uh, MXX845 crossed up there's a couple of bus stops EEC region that one there's a couple of cars here there's even a Ford Focus police car just right there and a Ford Focus there a Ford Focus Escort RS Turbo very nice car and there's also a police bike. Or just a normal bike. No, police bike. It's right there. There's a Leyland Tiger Cub. There's not really 60 buses here. But to be honest, guess what I've seen? I just realised. 
Look what's here. Ah it's CEO 2 UUP. A dinner start, which uh, which belonged to Cardiff. But it, it's still in cosigner colours. That is funny. Here we have a full open topper with a, a, a start up thing on the way you spin it around. This is a Leyland Titan TD4. And also, it's got one of these uh, moving automatic doors on this AEC uh, East Lang's uh, coach build works. Oh, that's St. Ellen's as well, that one. That's Portmouth Corporation. Leyland Titan PD2. Anyone want some milk? I don't think the rail. Nope, I don't think the rail. This is a Leyland. Nope, it's an AUC. AUC region. That's a bit weird for a reg flat, isn't it? That colour. Oh, it's an Australian city one. Oh, okay. That's why it's that colour. Ah, so it's a Sydney's uh, AUC region. I don't know why there's one here. Like that. There's no Leyland National there. But yeah, this is a. Oh, it's a house on there. The kitchen inside there. The Leyland Tiger. Right here. AEK514. Right, let's do some buses then. Let's go. Right, our first ride will be this Leyland National RTC 645L. Uh, just, uh, I do need all three. So, to be honest, luckily I did, I did go, to be honest. It's, at least I need all three of these. And maybe, in, maybe through the day, they might bring out some more. So I'll probably just stick around St. Helens area and do some like uh, airport runs or something on the on the 89 or something, you know, get them em Enviros in. This is uh, the first bus of the day. Close that window just for a video.
where we are again, back in St. Ellen's town centre. It was only a 10 minute run, so it's very bouncy this one. So I definitely haven't been on this. I've never seen a Leyland National bounce that much. Wow. Everyone was just flying out of their seats at the moment. <laughs> very bouncy on this. But yeah, back in the town centre now, so it might be the half, half cap close top. Leyland PD2, uh, numbered 50. Right, here's next. I think it's the uh, open top of next. Oh, it might be this one. I think it's. Is this one next? Yeah, please. Thank you. Let's sit here. Pretty cool. This is BED. It's the bed one. <laughs> Thank you. 
Here we are at St Helens Junction train station. Uh, just got a couple of minutes wait. Oh, I might be sitting off already. There's a bit of a tour going up on, on top boat, so I might, I might sit upstairs. Hello, mate. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Yep. I saw you were doing a little tour of it. Here we are back in St. Helens Town Centre. So it'll be the open topper next. Passengers on, you didn't know they were there. So, uh, the yeah, so, well, you know, we've got no insurance. Because there was no seats, obviously, for the people to sit on. But they just kind of bored and sat down chatting and that. <laughs> On this corner, we have an overhanging branch. We spoke to the minister, can we cut the branch off because it's causing an accident, cause an accident with the open topper? Uh, go and see the council. So we went and saw the council, and the council said, um, it's not my, up to us, it's up to the vicar to see. That could cheer on the corner right there, was the event interest. Away. Looks like there's another one just turned up, uh, a full open topper Daimler fleet line. Very nice. OFM 957K, so there's four buses out now. That's brilliant. Hopefully keep on coming. Alright guys, uh, the Daimler fleet line is next one on the list. So yeah, this is next. The Northern County's bodywork, very nice. 
can tell with the, uh, if it's an orphan cow is because it's got the the pillar thing uh, side panels on it. I do, and the uh, looks like a Leyland uh, Titans. It's got that uh, window at the back. It's got that window at the back, like a Leyland Titan. Very nice. I do like them windows though. That's pretty cool. There's the stop bell, just right there. And them windows are look cool for just uh, an armrest. Here we are back in St. Helens. No one wanted to say so I'll say it. Right, we're back at the depot. And uh, this up on topper is next. So we've got two open toppers here. Wait till the oh no, you don't want to come. Uh, you're coming. So let's take a photo.
with these two. There we go. New livery E400 MMC over there. So that was a nice ride on uh, Daimler Fleet Line with the Northern County's bodywork. Looks like Darth Vader's here. And you're watching football. Right, they look like they're boarding. Here we go. Uh, our last heritage bus of the day. Hopefully not. Hopefully another one comes in and all that stuff. I'll go upstairs when when after the video. Looks like Darth Vader just went upstairs. Looks like Darth Vader went upstairs too. He's coming for a ride. Oh god. <laughs> Here we are back at the Northwest Transport Museum. Well then guys, that's it really, uh, I guess um, not much to do here now apart from bus services, so let's see what's happening at the bus station shall we, because that's the, all four of them out and done, and that's going to be like the rest of the night now, rest of the day, so I'm guessing, I'm guessing bus services are, are pretty much, hopefully I can do that little mini solo watch running around as well. So, I might do this uh, Pulsar maybe, or a couple of uh, E400s, oh maybe not that Pulsar, hopefully I can do this, that's all I'm gonna but just pulled in. Let's let's have that as the first bus then. Don't know where it's a St Helens circular. Oh, it sounds beastly though. Yeah, let's do a round trip. Right. Just a round trip back here again. Yeah. I've just uh, I've got one this. Thank you. Well, I'm back in St. Ellen's. Very rapid bus up. So, I might do a 10 or maybe somewhat to Liverpool and then possibly go on the X2 down to, down to live the X2 down to Preston and then Blackpool or maybe do a bit of photos here and uh, also also just uh, see what's happening anyways let's see what turns up shall we
the bus coming around. I'm going to do this 29.87. Right, hopefully I can make this uh, ride because that sounded so whiny as all. So I'm just uh, fast walking to one of the crossings. It's a couple of a bus uh, full stars there. Just a couple of full stars there, and look what's here. Uh, Leyland that uh, Daimler fleet line up on top of Yeah, pal. I'm just doing a couple of uh, pulsars. Right. So, <laughs> not these 58 plate ones, though. Out, yeah, that's what I mean. Uh, that's why I get them now. See that? Right, let's. Well, to be fair, he's, he's, he's driving a proper bus. So I'm going to get this one to clock face on the 32A. And it's 
Right, just in clock face now. What a weird name for a estate. Well, it's I think there's a clock in the in the middle somewhere or anything like that. Or some and it shapes like a face or something. But yeah, he's got ten minutes uh for the bus to due out to St Helens. It's a pretty nice route to be honest. So there's my bus stop, my okay. Nice nice. And I should I should get a nice turning shot over there. So yeah, it's been sunny. What what's that? What's that? Look, there's a the sun out. It's very nice and warm today. Right, here we are. We've got ten minutes wait. Right guys, we're just back on it now. So back to St. Helens we go. Well guys, I think, uh, I don't know what to do now. Should I go back to the train station and go home? Or more buses? What do you think? I think I might do a couple more buses and uh, see what to take off. And hopefully, I might I might just go on another ride on to the open topper again. Right, guys, uh, just gonna do the open topper, and then and then probably catch the train back home. So I see a PD two over there, uh, which is the the cream on red one. And it looks like oh, I've just seen the I've just seen that one go back, so I might be able to get that one. So yeah, I'll see which one goes out first, and then head back to the train station, and then work from a train. That sounds like a plan. E two hundred MMC. Jumping on this again, but upstairs this time. All right, at the back. Here. Thank you for travelling with us today. Here we are, guys. Well, guys, that might be end of uh, today. It's about four o'clock nearly, and yeah, it's been pretty good to be fair for a Sunday. I know that was a bit meh. But at least I got three other vehicles in service work. Uh, two pulsars and one solo. Uh, maybe one day I'll come again and, you know, experience more, 
more service work around northwest. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. I won't end it just yet because I want to tell you what train I get on the way back. So whenever I do that, I'll see you at the train station. Right, we're just coming to the train station now. There we go. There's the train station. Let's see what time the next train is. To Blackpool North. Well, I've got one hour for the next train to Blackpool North. So I'm going to just wait to the bus station and then I'll go from there. I will be getting the 16. 42 so 4 442 pm train so i should arrive probably there at 1750 about 510 no sorry 550 so nearly six o'clock hopefully so that should do for the today because the bus museum finishes at four in about five minutes so there's no point going back there so i'm guessing just doing a couple of bus photos that'll do me hey guys back at the train station now and there's a nice sign right there I uh, just want to show you a bit of history. I think this uh, railway track is abandoned. Turning left, right over there, because yeah, it is abandoned. Because there's a big gate, obviously, there. And also, the stones uh, look a bit different to the, to the other ones. This is the thing about St. Helens Central. There's a lot of history. I bet there's uh, loads of um, loads of track work down there, covered up by nature. Oh, so yeah, pretty cool. This is the Liverpool Lime Street train. Right, my train is here now. I've got 
Yeah. Oh, have, have you been on a holiday? No, I've been staying at the bus since I was in Oh, Well then guys, this is uh, the time that I actually end the stream, uh, this, this video stream, I'm always streaming on my other channel, uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, I hope you like and subscribe, and also I'll see you on the next vlog, take care, bye for now.